Well, look who it is. I'll be damned. I was prepping the studio for our announcement, and here you are as a bonus. I had heard you'd taken a mechanic under your wing. What's the matter, girl? Couldn't find actual employment? The captain's treated me right. Better than any of you board folk ever have. I'm exactly where I want to be. And the convicts. Uh, the vicar. You know, most people, once they're out of prison, don't seem keen on returning. Oh, I would go anywhere to see you fall, sir. When you go off and get yourself shot, try to avoid taking one to the face. I'll want it recognizable to show to my citizens. My word! You've correctly identified the most recognizable man in the colony. Remarkable. It's a wonder what Phineas saw in you. Then again, he's an insane person. Thankfully, he's our insane person now. A proper company man. Yes, he is an extraordinarily obstinate fellow, isn't he? Fine, he isn't working for us per se. Semantics, he'll come around. But that's between us. As far as my adoring citizens will know, we've turned a dangerous crackpot into a working class man. It's a miracle. Oh yes, go on, wake them up, add more mouths to feed. That'll solve our starvation problems. I don't know what half-baked plans that simpleton in a lab coat has been leading you through, but it's done. It's over. Let me ask you something, Captain. Have you at any point thought about not fucking up our entire society? I believe we could ask you the same. I'm making actual progress towards stabilization and recovery. You're just getting in the way. If I and my people can ride it out in luxury and happiness, yes, yes, I would. I don't know if you've noticed, Captain, but Halcyon's pretty much a lost cause. I'll admit, there's no shortage of talent in the scientists and engineers there. Look, I'm not an unreasonable man. If you manage to storm the castle, as it were, and make it out of here with Phineas alive, can't exactly afford more havoc than you've already caused. Fine. If you survive, you'll need someone to sell the rest of the board on your plan. Captain, you have an uncanny talent for complicating my life. You've been working with Dr. Wells from the beginning. When we moved to arrest him, he was prepared. I lost good soldiers in the attempt. You've disrupted the balance of power. You've upset the natural order of things. You've introduced uncertainty, and there is nothing I despise more than uncertainty. I'm afraid I can't do that. To your credit, Captain, you are one of the colony's finest specialists. Your technical abilities are beyond reproach. For all your talents, you are the enemy of Halcyon, and therefore you are my enemy. Hmm. You make a nuanced and compelling argument. Here's my rebuttal. No. Dr. Wells is being held in my custody. His cooperation will prove invaluable, even if I have to beat it out of him. All that's left to do is put down this riot arrest you, and then get on with the bloody business of saving this colony. Fair enough. I'm giving you exactly one chance to parlay with me. Interesting that you think I'm going to die here. I believe I'm more than capable of taking you on. Fair point. I don't know how you've managed to defy the odds. By every reasonable estimate, you should be dead. Yet here you stand. I've devoted my entire life to protecting Halcyon. I'm not afraid to die in the line of duty. There isn't much of a board left, thanks to you. You've thrown this system into disarray. Cleaning up your mess will be the work of a lifetime. You were always an unknown variable. I tried to recruit you. 
but you threw your lot in with that madman, Phineas Wells. I'm aware of Dr. Wells' plan. Revive some brilliant scientists and engineers from the Hope and work with them to save the colony. He's already revived you, after all. Fifty or sixty years ago, I might have agreed with you. But we've passed the point of no return. The best scientists in Halcyon can't save us now. I appreciate your confidence, Captain. But so long as you're allied with Dr. Wells, we can never work together. I haven't given up on the program yet. You've caused some complications, but I can improvise. I can fix this. I haven't lost control of the Labyrinth yet. Our security system is still operational. I can still put a stop to you. When you put it that way, no. Not in the least. Damn it all. Very well. You win. I'm familiar enough with your methods to realize my chances of survival are low. Congratulations, Captain. You've outplayed me. I accept your terms and will return Dr. Wells to your care. I just hope you've made the right decision. The fate of the colony is in your hands now. I bid you farewell, Captain. <laughs>